today. George is here now with a look at the forecast and also some mm -hmm. storms that are on the way. We are going to see more areas of rain and stormy weather returning. Seems like we had a bunch of rain recently, right? No kidding. We've had <laughs> enough, but uh, it is that time of year. It's not going to be quite as heavy as what we saw over the weekend, but still we're going to see more rain moving on in, so you'll need your umbrellas ready to go. But first off, Libby, we want to talk about the dry weather. Two things we want to tell you about tonight. The Tulsa Drillers, mm -hmm. Taft Price is going to give his 99 mile an hour fastball first pitch <laughs> of the game at 4.05. We've seen him practicing. He's here good. in the studio mm -hmm. with we have, some paper balls. <laughs> we have a trash can here in the studio, and he likes to fire those fastballs in there. Yeah. 73 degrees for the first pitch at One Oak Field. Then after that, I am going to be out at One Oak Field for Home Run for the Homeless. This is a charity softball game. It's a lot of fun. All the local TV folks playing the radio stations. That game is going to get going towards 7 p.m., and I welcome you to come out and enjoy it. It's really a lot of fun, and the children seem to enjoy it as well. For that, looking at 70 degrees, almost said for the kickoff, 70, 70 degrees for the first pitch, falling into the lower 60s throughout the game, and then by tomorrow morning, we'll see temps in the 50s. Now, we are tracking a lot of changes. Here's a summary of what's headed our way. Tomorrow morning, I have both the cycling guy. By the way, I'm going to be riding my bicycle to work tomorrow morning during the newscast from 5 to 7 a.m. Libby will see how well that goes. And we'll also see a few showers around for tomorrow morning, but most of the rain is going to fall during the PM hours on Wednesday into Wednesday night and Thursday. And for the weekend, we'll be tracking yet more rain. Across Oklahoma today, not expecting any strong storms anywhere or any rain as the rain is staying to our south. If you have some travel plans, you'll see some rain developing down in Texas, and a few strong storms are possible out through parts of West Texas. Now, as far as the rain tomorrow, I am not anticipating any major severe weather across Oklahoma. This map shows that for tomorrow, we're going to see a chance for showers and thunderstorms. It is possible there could be a severe thunderstorm warning or two for marginal severe storms in the state, but we're not expecting anything significant. A few stronger storms are possible down through parts of West and South Texas. Temps right now are looking good. We're in the lower 60s. Benita's up to 62, 61 Tahlequah, 63 in Bristow, and Bartlesville, the sun is shining and the temp is at 61. We have some high clouds right now, 63. The air is really Really dry out there, making the weather feel quite pleasant. We have an east and northeast breeze at nine miles an hour. On the future trek, 5 p.m. today, we'll have dry weather across the state. You will notice changes by tomorrow morning. Now at 7 a.m., here's the future track Wednesday at 7. It is showing some areas of rain spreading into Oklahoma, mainly from Oklahoma City and the southern parts of the state. Interpret this to mean is that between 7 and noon, we will see increasing chances for light showers. This is showing that at lunchtime tomorrow, Light to moderate rain is going to be possible. The bulk of the rain is going to fall during the afternoon hours, and overall, we're going to see heavier amounts of rain to the west, and less rain is going to fall to the east over toward Fayetteville and Fort Smith. So your forecast for today, enjoy the nice weather. Enjoy the beautiful day today. We'll have high clouds, mostly sunny skies, and a high reaching 73. Around the rest of green country, Bartlesville 72, 72 Tahlequah, 73 toward Fort, Mo Fort Morris. Morris. Fort Gibson and Muskogee. I tried to combine several towns on that one, Libby. And Bristol will see 73. Coming up tonight, we'll see a low of 54. Dry this evening. Great weather for home run for the homeless at One Oak Field. Now, by tomorrow morning, we will see a few showers moving in with these temps in the 40s and 50s. And as we are going to see a few batches of rain trying to move in tomorrow morning, that is going to help to hold down the temperatures. So running cooler tomorrow, we'll see a high of 68. Most rain falls during the PM hours through Thursday morning. And for the weekend, of course, we have May Fest coming up for Saturday and Sunday. We'll see chances for showers and thunderstorms. This was my first pitch out of the Tulsa Drillers game the other night, and this was possibly the worst first pitch you have ever seen. Look at the baseball. It is up high. Well, but your form looks good to me. That's the only part that looks good. My pitch went sailing over the oh, catcher, no. and it was such a bad pitch, the catcher didn't even move. <laughs> <laughs> he just knew it was way over his head, huh? The catcher just kind of stayed right here yeah. and just watched it go sailing over his head. <laughs> well, I bet people cheered for you anyway. It was a good time. Yeah. <laughs> we'll hope fun. for better results tonight. Yes, we will check in with you on that tomorrow then. All right. Thanks, George. Well, this morning we are learning that more.